several world-class bucks. His secret? Hunt where big bucks live and use Evercom. Evercom is the first calming scent. It puts deer at ease. It's a collection of smells from deer bedding areas, which deer associate with safety. Evercom reassures nervous deer and can cover up mistakes. It comes in stick form. Just wipe it on. It won't wash away, spill, or freeze. The reason for my success is Evercom. I will not hunt without it. Just one arrow, and you'll know. Bear archery. Walk among legends. Whitetail Underdogs The Drive is brought to you in part by the following sponsors. Bear Archery Products. Trophy Ridge. Conquest Sense. Easton Archery Products. Aggressive Game Calls. And Bojacks. Hi, I'm Craig Bouchelle. Welcome to The Drive. On this week's show, in addition to our usual visit to the Underdogs Armory, we'll be bringing you two whitetail hunts from South Jersey. The first hunt is with Whitetail Underdog's newest pro staffer, Andrew Owens, on public land. And the second hunt is with Whitetail Underdog's pro staffer, Rudy Dana. Now let's get right to some hunting action. Stay tuned. 
Archery at the Glen in Allentown is dedicated to the archer and angler, providing unsurpassed services to the Lehigh Valley since 1999. Whether your passion is hunting or target archery, Archery at the Glen specializes in and services all compound, recurve, and crossbows. There are leagues and lessons for people of all ages that are spacious and draw range. For anglers, we offer a wide variety of fishing tackle and live bait year-round, as well as hunting and fishing licenses. Check us out online at theglen.com. Get in the game at Archery at the Glen. Dr. Algello, Health and Body Makeover, located at 1578 Easton Avenue in Bethlehem, specializing in weight loss, neuropathy, and chiropractic. Contact them today at 1-888-BURN-FAT. As a financial advisor, Beverly helps clients invest for all stages of their lives. Each client's portfolio is unique to their specific needs. Visit BeverlySYoung.com to learn more. Janie Montgomery Scott, member FINRA and SIPC. Located on the eastern shore of Maryland, Talbot County Outfitters is a top destination for hunters that truly understand a fair chase hunt. No matter if you're interested in whitetail or sick deer, Canadian geese, sea ducks, or turkey hunting, we are here to guide you in the right direction. We are committed to providing each and every hunter with the opportunity to make their hunt one they will remember for a lifetime. Check us out online at TalbotCountyOutfitter.com. Talbot County Outfitters, killing for a living. Archery Addictions is stocked up and ready to get you all bowed up. Archery Addictions is open seven days a week and is the ultimate archery destination. Visit them at archeryaddictions.com and get geared up for a great season. Okay guys, we just found that arrow covered in blood. I mean, it couldn't have been a more perfect shot. We were in the tree all of 15, 20 minutes today and that first deer came in and this one came following it. So we got down, as soon as we found the arrow, we looked up, you can see a white belly 60 yards away. So. Couldn't ask for a better hunt. I'm here with my dad. He's behind the camera for me. I can't thank him enough for coming out. So we're going to go see how big it is now and uh, see what we got. All 
awesome, awesome public land bow hunt. I mean, that's how it is in Jersey. I mean, we'll grow some big deer, but a lot of times out here, public land, you got to take what you can get. And I mean, this is a perfect example of a nice eight pointer out here hunting these swamps. I mean, you'll see as we come out here when we drag this deer out, it is nothing but waist deep water for a lot of it. And we've got a little trail cut out where we can actually walk in some shallow water. So you got to work hard to get these deer. It's not easy. It's not hunting open fields on farms. You can see how thick this woods is. I mean, we uh, we take a lot of time to clear our spots, set, set, these, set these sets up, and uh, you know get our time and, and really get on these deer. We only get one or two shots at them a year, and uh, I was fortunate enough to come out here with my dad. This is the last week for me. I head out next week with Rudy. We're going to go out to Kentucky and film out there, hopefully get a big deer on camera. But uh, just managed to throw something together today, and uh, we were lucky. I mean, perfect shot, you can see. Bear Bow did an awesome job, and uh, I can't ask for anything better. I'm just just blessed to be out here and uh, hunt with my dad, and you know you'll remember this one forever. So uh, we got it done today, underdog style, and uh, got this beautiful eight pointer. So stay tuned for some more hunts, and uh, hopefully uh, we do good in Kentucky out for you guys. All right, see ya. What a great hunt! That's a perfect example of public land success. Sometimes if you just give it a shot, you can be fortunate enough to get a crack at a good buck like Andrew did. Great job, guys. Now before we get to our second hunt, let's go see what Frank's up to in the underdog's armory. Today's segment is brought to you by Nikon. You can check out all their great optics at NikonSportOptics.com. How's it going everyone? I'm Frank and welcome back to another segment of Underdog Armory. Now I've got all our builds wrapped up. Uh, everything looks good. We're ready to go to the range. Uh, the last thing we need to do is get some optics on here so we can see what we're shooting at. Now some of these optics I had off of other rifles and other builds and some were sent to us for the show. So I'm just going to run through the uh, optics I had already, and then I'll talk to you a little bit about the ones that were sent to us. Uh, so for our 300 blackout, we're going to use a Burris MTAC on top of a pepper mount. Uh, I had this on a previous build. It's a great optics, and it should do uh, a great job for our 300. On our SPR build, we're going to use a Leupold uh, 3-9 uh, Mark AR, sitting on some tally rings with a uh, Burris Fastfire on an offset mount. Uh, should be a great option for that rifle. Uh, the tally rings um, I use on one of my hunting rifles. I gave them a call and I asked them if they'd like to send out some of their tactical rings. Uh, these things are great. They come in a four and a six screw. They're uh, machined together and serial numbered so the parts can't get uh, crossed up. They got these two little lugs on the bottom and uh, when you lock this down to a Picatinny rail it is rock solid. I mean, these things are unbelievable. Uh, I got these cool little crossbones on there too. And uh, you can go to Tally's website, check out all the different mounts they make, and uh, just fantastic stuff. Uh, thank you, Tally Manufacturing. On our pistol build, I uh, just used a uh, Strike Fire from Vortex with a set of uh, Midwest Industries backup sights. Now, uh, Midwest did send some parts out for us to use this season. Unfortunately, I didn't get a chance to use them because uh, the rest of the parts for the 308 uh, didn't make it in time. Uh, I will get this thing built for you, hopefully this season coming up. And uh, I will shoot it at the range when we go out. Uh, just I don't have all the uppers built yet. Um, on our Rebel build, I don't have the optics yet. Hopefully they'll be here before we go to the range. Uh, in the meantime, we're going to use these backup sights from AT3 Tactical. Uh, if you missed the episode where we uh, talked about rails, um, we talked a little bit about AT3. They make uh, some great parts, uh, quality materials, and a fraction of the price. Uh, if you don't have a ton of money, these are a great way to go. We also have a pair of their uh, offset uh, backup sites as well uh, that I've been using on the 308. Uh, I put them on there because I wanted to see if they would hold up on, that, on the pounding of the 308, and uh, no issues. Uh, they held up great, so I uh, will uh, put them back on there. 
The uh, rest of the optics we have were sent to us from Nikon. They've been a longtime sponsor of the show. And uh, they were nice enough to send me some scopes to use for um, the new firearm segments. Uh, the first one we have here is the uh, 4 to 16 M308. It has uh, multi coated lenses, it has a great eye relief, uh, adjustable turrets. It uh, also has the uh, spot on ballistic technology. You can go online, put the uh, load in that you're using, and it will spit all the information out for you. Um, it's a great scope, comes with a kill flash, flip, uh, flip up lens caps, and it should do a great job up on top of this thing. The other two we have are the new 1.5 to 6 by 24s. These are a 30 millimeter tube, also with uh, adjustable uh, caps, uh, multi coated lenses. We have their mounts as well. Uh, we also have it in um, the illuminated reticle. It's actually more of a fire dot. Uh, you can use it as a red dot or a uh, scope. And I got to say, I'm pretty impressed with these things. Uh, the glass is super clear. I mean, these things are really nice. I can't wait to get them on a rifle and shoot them. Um, thank you, Nikon, for helping me out this season. So uh, that's the optics we have, guys. That's what we're going to be using. These are all quality optics. Uh, when we get back from the break, we're going to do a quick wrap-up before we go to the range. And uh, make sure you stick around. I'll see you soon. Laszlo Roofing and Siding, located in Bethlehem. Family-owned for over 25 years. Visit us online at LazloRoofing.com or call 610-868-9855. Laszlo Roofing and Siding, we've got you covered. Bagel Basket is Hellertown's finest deli and bagel shop. We offer fresh, homemade bagels made daily in 12 different varieties with 14 cream cheese spreads to choose from along with homemade egg sandwiches and pastries. We also have salads, appetizers, hot and cold sandwiches, cold cuts, and microwavable dinners to go. Call ahead or walk-in services are available. Minutes away from Route 78, Lehigh University, and Stabler Arena, visit us today or call 610-838-6667. This segment of Underdog Armory is brought to you by Rebel Arms. You can visit their website at rebelarms.com. How's it going everybody? Welcome back. I've got all our optics installed, our builds are finished up, and the next step is to go to the range. Uh, before we head out though, I just want to do a quick wrap up down here in the shop. And uh, thank you guys for sticking with us this season. Uh, the firearm segments are new to Whitetail Underdogs this year. And uh, the reason we did these builds for you is so we had some platforms to work off of for this season and next. And to bring you some quality parts that we can give you our honest opinion on. Uh, I think we've done a great job with that. Um, we have a lot of great parts here that we'll be testing at the range. And we have some great things lined up for next season as well. Uh, we'll be doing some long range shooting. Uh, we have some suppressors coming from Yankee Hill, AAC. Uh, Hunter Town Arms, Thompson Machine, Proto Tactical, and there's a few other in there as well. Uh, I'm not going to give away everything. Uh, you guys got to come back if you want to see it. Uh, also, I got to thank our sponsors. Uh, we could not have done this without them. Uh, thank you very much, guys. So uh, that's it for down here. And uh, next time you see these guns, we will be at the range. So be sure to come back next week, and I'll see you there, guys. Take care. Trophy of a lifetime, you got to get aggressive. Let Hydro Graphics World transform your hunting gear. Camouflage anything from your tree stand to your truck interior. You dream it, we dip it. Why pay thousands to airbrush? Hydro Graphics World will custom design your motorcycles, ATVs for less. Cars, trucks, we will blow you away with thousands of films to choose from on our website. From one item to full production line, Hydro Graphics World will bring your product to a new level. You dream it, we dip it. Visit HydroGraphicsWorld.com. Well, we hope all you gun enthusiasts out there are enjoying the Underdog's Armory. 
Frank's doing a great job with these AR builds. Now this second hunt is with Whitetail Underdogs pro staffer Rudy Dana, and he's got Andrew behind the camera. They're hunting over a field, and there's plenty of deer on their feet feeding. Let's go see what happens. Here we are back in New Jersey. Just got back from Talbot County Outfitters in St. Michael's, Maryland. We were, uh, we were down there, I was actually filming uh, Mark Davis, and Craig was filming Jason. Um, boys didn't have the greatest luck. We got back in town last night. We're, uh, so I'm gonna head out this morning. I got a spot with a nice buck. Try to get something down on footage for film, for camera. Got my main man, Aaron Dahl, behind the camera this morning. Bear with us, he's gonna be a great cameraman, I'm sure. Uh, as long as he hits the red button. But uh, stay tuned, and we'll get back to you. See if we can smoke a big one, underdog style. Introducing Easton Bowfire, the next generation carbon arrow that combines a striking white hot graphic with higher velocity and accurate shooting. Designed for today's cutting edge bows. Bowfire features an advanced all carbon makeup that carries plenty of energy downrange to drive broadheads through the target. Bullfire features a white hot design for a visible line of sight to the point of impact. Light up big game on your next hunt with Easton High Velocity Bullfire. Got the job done. I want to get down and go see where she's at. She died out in the middle of the field, so she's definitely down. We watched her fall, so the shot was good. We reviewed the footage, it was awesome. Aaron didn't do a bad job behind the camera for a second time. At least he hit the record button. That's all we're worried about. <laughs> just got that. We just smoked that dough. It's been about an hour. We waited. She's definitely down in the field. We can see her with binoculars. Let's go recover this old pig. Hopefully passed her a nice two blade raid. Did the trick this morning, boy. There she is. You on her?
Jackson. He's a big one. Wow. Ah, oh, dude. That's perfect. <laughs> Come on, get huh? That's how you do it, man. A little far back, but. Yeah. She was quartered away, though, so I mean, it worked out perfect. That's how you do it, man. That's it. A little throat management. What do you say, a little meat in the freezer? Never heard anyone. Absolutely. Anyways. And there's going to be cold. Yep. Cold, cold. Bear agenda got it done this morning, man. Aaron, thank you for running the camera for me, buddy. Anytime. Look at that hole, bro. That particular hunt shows us how important cameraman communication can be. Even though they kind of missed the impact with camera one, they were still able to get it on camera two. Great recovery, guys. As always, we hope you enjoyed the show. Don't forget to catch us next week for some more action. See you next time on The Drive.